number one. motorcycles when I was 22 years old. I had so much fun riding on the street. I had a 1987 VFR 7, 700? 700. <laughs> that was an awesome bike. Awesome bike. I totaled it. I have tons of footage and videos from over the summer that I want to talk about and go over and each individual like growth period. There were a lot of one-on-ones that I did with Pridmore. There were schools that I've done and I want to go to like every single school and do reviews for them and like share what it was like and take you guys with me there and take this channel to all the racetracks and everything. I'm going to take you guys with me on this kind of stuff and it might be rough and it might be brutal and there might be some times where I look like a drowned sewer rat because when I take that helmet off after riding in 100 degree heat for 25 minutes, not pretty. <laughs> so when I was racing at Utah Motorsports Campus, I think it was like the second time I raced there, this little like seven-year-old girl came up to me and I was in my full leathers and she kind of looked at me and like she eyes me up and down. She goes, are you racing motorcycles? I'm like, yep, I race motorcycles. And she's like, well, which bike is yours? I'm like, it's this one right here. She goes, oh, I like your pink stickers. I'm like, thanks, I do too. I made them myself. She's like, oh, well, that's cool. She's like, I have a scooter. I'm like, oh, you ride bicycles too? She goes, yeah, I, I ride bicycles. And uh, I'm like, oh, you ride dirt bikes? And she's like, oh, I'll get one. I'll get one next year or maybe, you know. And uh, it was so cool because I could see like her gears turning and she's like, oh, I could totally do that, you know. Um, So I had a moment when she was like, I really like your pink stickers. And I just, just the look on her face where I was like, I need everything to be pink. Like I need all of this to be for those little seven year old girls like walk up to me. Like the whole thing, we gotta, we gotta redo the whole plan. No more matte black, no more looking cool, no more one of the boys. Paint the whole thing pink. The whole thing needs to be pink. <laughs> I'm like, I am going to be like the mascot for like, <laughs> for eight year olds. <laughs> and that's another thing that I wanted to start this YouTube channel for is that there are so many girls out there that put around on the street and, you know, are scared of a sport bike or are scared of getting a 600 or are scared of, you know, there is so much to be afraid of, which is valid, rightly so. There is a lot to be afraid of. Sorry for the little sound. That's my cat Pip. She's licking herself and has a bell on her collar. <laughs> And like, whether it's on a bike or just in life, we're all looking for a way to overcome fear and to improve who we are as people, which is the, the whole point, right? So that's kind of the journey I'm on and just overcoming more fears and starting this YouTube channel is one of those fears. And like, I just need to sit down and talk about it and post the video online and just get that first one out of the way. <laughs> That's what we're doing here. We're getting the first one out of the way. Um, hit the subscribe button, hit the notification things. I'm going to put up a new video every week. There are a lot of things I've noticed and read that I want to talk about and I don't want to get into it in this video. I just want to say hello and kind of rip the band-aid off and post something. So definitely I'm going to show you some cool footage that I've taken over the summer. And if you guys have any questions, if there's anything you want me to talk about, uh, hit me up. But I'm going to show you some cool stuff, and I will see you soon. Oh, Pip, we have so much to do. It's going to be an awesome day, you guys.